it's a big race weekend and uh, the weather may not be cooperating. We are looking at, yes, the possibility of rain throughout much of the morning hours on Sunday, but the latest models are actually trying to get that rain out of here a little bit earlier. People so, will be happy to hear that. I think we have a little good news in the forecast. <laughs> Let's take a look uh, at the radar. This is over the last three hours and we had that storm just kind of blow up and sit over downtown Birmingham, dumping quite a bit of rain. We saw one to two inches of rainfall as that uh, that system just kind of sat over downtown Birmingham. Storm is on the move now, though. I did want to take you down to Birmingham where we are looking at a flood advisory. This is going to last through midnight. The good news is that you don't see any rain within this green box. So conditions will be improving over the next couple of hours. Here's where the rain is right now. We've got some light rain along I-20 near Pell City, some rain falling over the city of Talladega and some rain in Munford right now. Through the rest of the evening, we're fairly quiet. We'll have a mainly cloudy sky, chance for a passing shower overnight, but most are dry. Looking towards tomorrow morning, 6 a.m. A few passing showers possible, but most are dry with temperatures in the 60s to start the day. As we move towards tomorrow afternoon, we end up in the upper 60s and low 70s under a mainly cloudy sky. Better coverage of rain moves in by tomorrow afternoon and rain showers will be increasing in coverage tomorrow evening. So we're looking at widespread to numerous showers late tomorrow night into early on Sunday. The big story Sunday, along with the chance of rain, of course, is going to be our temperatures. I wanted to point out that temperature right there. High of 58 on Sunday. That's going to be a shocking change from the 80s we've gotten used to lately. Let's time out the day Sunday. This is some of the latest modeling for Sunday. Very wet at 9 a.m. across all of central Alabama. Lunchtime rain mainly along into the east of I-65 and the latest model trends are trying to get that rain out of here by the earlier part of the afternoon. We will likely still have clouds around still going to be a little bit damp, but we should see a drying trend through the second half of the day Sunday. Very chilly temperatures though. Be prepared for 50s and low 60s. That's as warm as we get throughout the afternoon and evening hours. A look towards 6 p.m. does show that clearing trend really kicking in by about dinner time. So trends are good for Sunday. Let's talk more about the next seven days. We are going to be wet at times tomorrow, especially the second half of the day. It looks like we're drying out by the second half of the day Sunday, and then we remain dry throughout much of next week. We are looking good, although we're going to be very chilly Sunday. We warm early next week to near 70 degrees on Monday, but a lot of folks very happy to hear about that updated forecast. On I'm Sunday. pumped for everyone now. Yeah. Look at that.